Morning, Alistair ran over here because he wants to tell you what I was just about to tell you. So Hello. first of all, it's Wednesday morning. We are just about headed off to preschool. And we have ants okay. now. Well, we have ants in our house and I'm stomping on them because they're just trying to get beans food. They're so dignified. Alistair just said, kids, never say that grown-ups are undignified because that's just mean. Anyways, um, yeah, Alistair just noticed that we have ants in our house. I don't know why I said it like that, ants, but um, <laughs> no. we have ants in our house and we usually have an ant problem right around spring um, all the way through summer and it's really, really bad. Like we have to have an exterminator come out and uh, it's frustrating and so, yep, Alistair just noticed we have a ton of teeny little baby ants. So frustrating, but we have to get out the door right now because we have preschool today. Normally we have it on Friday, but we are switching to Wednesdays. Um, and yeah, so we're gonna have to figure out that ant problem. Come on, come on. It doesn't work in my hand. We are gonna have to move Bean's food dish, obviously. Bean, come on. I mean ants. Come on, it's come in my hand. Also, Look what we did last night, you guys. If you don't know, Hans has a strong love for Ben and Jerry's ice cream, and Ben and Jerry's ice cream is usually pretty expensive. Well, Fred Meyer was having it half off, and last night Hans was seriously filling up the cart, and I was just like, whoa, dude. But, you know, he wanted, he was a good sale, and he really wanted ice cream, apparently. You okay? But, so I think we're good to go on ice cream and I probably, I probably shouldn't have showed you guys that, but I already did. So we're gonna go to preschool now. I'm actually going to leave the camera here today. Um, just cause, yeah, I don't know. I just want, I don't always wanna have a camera at preschool, you know? So we will see you later today and Hans and I actually have a date tonight. We are going to a movie, I think it's called The Martian. I honestly don't even know what it's about. Um, but yeah, we are going, so gotta go. We are back from preschool. We had to run a few errands afterwards and um, I actually have to film just a few clips uh, for a video. Uh, it's so frustrating that we have ants like this early. Like it's not even spring yet, but seriously, like we, we, we will probably have to call an exterminator. Is that what it's called? It doesn't seem right. <laughs> Anyways, we're going to probably have to yeah, call someone to help us because the ant problem, like, it's, it's going to get bad whether or not we have ant traps, so. All right, we have to get out the door right now because we are, you know, running late to our date and I had to wake Allie up and he's waking up kind of slow, but he's in a good mood. He wants to bring Bean um, to Aww. his nanny and papa's. Are you excited to go to nanny and papa's, Allie? <laughs> He's playing with Bean, you guys can't really see. Oh, he's cuddling. So yes, I'm excited. We're gonna go to a movie, and I looked up this movie, I'm a Martian, and I think I'll like it. Good morning, guys, except this isn't really good morning in the vlog. Um, I think that we honestly just stopped vlogging. Oh, it was on the night that Hans and I were having a date night, so that would have been Wednesday. And so things got a little hectic that night. So we went to drop Alistair off and I stayed in the car. We were running kind of late and Hans went to go drop him off at his parents' house. And it seemed like it was taking him a while. Normally Hans is like pretty quick about, you know, dropping him off and stuff. So I was kind of wondering what the heck was going on. And Hans came out like shaking his head and I was like, okay. And he opened the door and said, Alistair is hyperventilating. You have to come in here, I guess. And I was like, what the heck? So apparently Alistair was freaking out about us leaving him. And it's so odd because he has gone to, or yeah, he goes to Han's parents all the time. He hasn't been there in a little while, like overnight or like by himself. I mean, not a very long time, but that's the only thing that I could think of. So I went in there and yeah, Alistair was just like flipping out, not like going crazy or anything, but just crying really, really bad. And, <clears throat> So at that point, it was too late for us to go see the movie, and that was kind of a bummer because that was like our um, Valentine's Day date, you know. Um, and so it was weird. The only th the other thing I could think of is that I did have to wake Alistair up from a nap 
right before we left so i guess maybe he was just like super out of it and still a little grumpy maybe um because we ended up staying inside with him and he basically warmed up and he picked out toys and he was playing with han's dad and so hans and i were like all right well we're still gonna leave we couldn't go see the movie we wanted to see the martian but we went we basically we got some to-go food and actually we just came home and watched a show and hung out here um we were gonna like go out to dinner or something but i don't know hans and i really just enjoy like having quiet time at home so that's what we did um and then we went out and picked up Alistair like a few hours later and he was perfectly fine and the next day he actually asked to go back to their house and I was like, dude. We are just letting the car warm up for a minute. It's really cold and I have my seat warmers on but it takes a minute to warm them up. So Alistair and I have a few errands to run. We have to go to Target, we have to go to the post office and I feel like there's one other place but I can't remember. So I just sold eight things on ebay i have this big bag here it doesn't look that big but it's actually pretty heavy because i have a breast pump in there um just like the machine part i have um what else four cloth diapers um something else that's heavy but i can't really remember oh a maternity jacket that actually sold for $1.99 which is kind of a bummer but that's kind of the risk you take selling stuff on eBay but I actually sold um, a few other things for like a lot more than I thought I would get um, I can't remember anyways okay guys well we are headed off